Hello friends, good morning, buenos dias. We are coming to you from a beautiful place in Costa Rica called Mystica Retreat Center with a morning practice that is gentle, rejuvenating, and really is going to help you get your day started. Now I want you to get cozy for this practice. I'm feeling cozy right now. I'm actually wearing a brand new Boho Beautiful t-shirt, as you can see. I grabbed this from Mark's closet because I felt like wearing an oversized shirt. But it's super exciting because we've never had t-shirts or anything like this to offer, and this is the first time. So if you want to check it out, you can go to our Boho Beautiful website and see everything there. But for today's practice, this is a perfect practice for you to do, literally like I mentioned, the minute you get out of bed. It's going to be gentle. It's just to really get your body moving, your mind connected to the body, and wake up from the inside out so you can have a beautiful, beautiful day. So let's get started. We're gonna begin today just in an easy seated position and drop your shoulders down away from the ears. And to get started, first let's close our eyes, rest your hands on the knees, and take a deep breath in. Just taking this opportunity to welcome the day, to welcome this new opportunity that we have today to live our life to its fullest potential. So feeling yourself grounded on the mat, feeling yourself balanced, being open and mindful of anything that your body may be experiencing right now. Maybe it's a little achy, a little sore, maybe it's tired. Wherever you are in this moment, it's totally perfect. Drop your shoulders down away from the ears. And then as you open your eyes, let's just begin to start to welcome movement into the top of our body, into our neck. Starting to roll your head to the left, couple times and then reverse it other direction to the right beautiful and now make sure that your right foot is in front of your left as you're sitting in your cross-legged position if it's not go ahead and come into that position on your inhale open up your arms and just give yourself a big stretch Lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. Open up through the chest cavity. Inhale. Good. And as you exhale now, your left arm comes on top of your right. And you're going to give yourself a big hug and see if you can reach for your shoulder blades behind you. So really stretching out, looking up towards the ceiling. And then as you exhale, just bring your body forward now. So trying to touch your elbows towards the ground. Good. And just hold in this position. Feel a very gentle stretch through your hips, through the shoulders. And then slowly come back up, open up, release. Ah, just give a big sigh. And then switch your feet so now your left foot is in front of your right. Open up again. And then exhale, left arm comes underneath your right arm. Come down. Good. Just a little stretch. Maybe you want to hover and just kind of hold here. Maybe you want to come all the way down with your forehead again. You're going to just check in with how your body is feeling. I find that in the mornings, our bodies are quite stiff. So it's, it's good to be slow and gentle. Great. Come back up. Open up. Deep breath in. Exhale now. Right arm drops down as you take a stretch. Look up to the sky. And just be very mindful that your sit bone does not come off the mat. So you want to stay grounded here and really breathing into the side body. And if you feel any resistance happening here, just deepen the breath a little bit more and guide your breath into that particular area of your body that you feel that extra soreness. Awesome, come back to center. Maybe switch your feet just so we're evening it all out. Inhale, exhale, other arm comes down, reach, look up. And just lengthening through the side body here. And breathing deeply. 
and exhale out good just make it feel amazing in your body breathing into any stiffness tension soreness maybe you want to use ujjayi breathing where you make that gentle humming ocean sound in the back of your throat inhale exhale awesome come back to center beautiful and then from here we're just going to bring our knees together swing your feet around and let's come over to the very back of our mat good now we're going to tuck our toes underneath and just give those toes a nice stretch maybe bring your knees above the floor a couple times and this is really important because we very rarely actually think about our feet we just always go for the shoulders, the, the full body, right? But the feet are so important because if you're going to be wearing shoes all day or, what, or whatever you're going to be doing today, it's just nice to give those toes a nice stretch. So tuck those toes in. Just sit on top of your heels. Maybe do a little rocking forward, back. Again, you got to just make this practice feel good on your body. So do whatever you got to do. Good. And then from this position, inhaling and just reaching both of your arms up to the sky, interlacing the fingers, index fingers pointed up. And just breathe as you lengthen here. Open up through that chest. Maybe lean back just a little bit. Awesome. Exhale. Come down. Release the toes now. And we're going to sit right into child's pose. So rounding out the spine, reaching those fingertips forward, forehead comes down. And maybe doing a little rock left and right here. And it's always nice to add a little movement because, like I mentioned, in the mornings, your body can just have that extra resistance. So by moving a little bit left and right or whatever direction feels good for you, you're just providing a little bit more space for your body to let go and relax into. Let's just hold this child's pose now in stillness as we focus on three deep breaths, inhaling into your lower back and exhaling, just allowing your body to melt and relax into this posture. And again, maybe your arms feel better next to your side. That's totally fine as well. Just a really nice release for the back here. And one last breath in. Exhale out. Slowly rolling up. Now vertebra by vertebra coming over towards all fours position. And let's just awaken the spinal cord here. Inhaling, arch and drop as you look up to the sky. Exhale, tuck that chin to the chest and round like an angry cat. Get inhale, drop the belly, look up. Maybe look up to the sky. Exhale round and release inhale arch exhale round one more time inhale arch exhale round good tuck your toes now come back to neutral we're gonna slowly make our way into that downward dog but again, being very mindful and gentle because it is the very beginning of our day. Push back with your hips, but keep your knees bent here, all right? So it's like a bent knee downward dog. Start by focusing first on the upper body. So really allowing yourself to lengthen through the shoulders. Drop the shoulders away from the ears. Spread those fingers wide. And then once you feel like you got a really beautiful elongation in the spine happening, then begin to just start to extend one knee at a time and just see how far you can bring that heel down. Again, you don't have to touch it to the ground. You might want to give your body a little extra time for that today, but just walk it out on one spot. I like to also add a little movement into the hips. Again, that just feels good on my body. So if you want to do the same, go ahead. If not, just do whatever feels good for you. Good, and then maybe as you begin to Feel the release of your uh, hamstrings, of your calf muscles. Then maybe you want to just come into that downward dog and just find stillness for three breaths here again. Inhale. Nice, relaxing, calming ujjayi breath out. Inhale again. Exhale out. 
inhale again and exhale now let's slowly begin to walk our feet towards the front of the mat bending your knees grabbing the opposite elbows relax your head and just rock to the left and right allow yourself to be super heavy here super relaxed allow your head to be relaxed Awesome. And then rest your fingertips onto the mat. Inhale, just look forward. Maybe extend your knees if you can. And then exhale, sit over back onto the mat again. Good. And then from this position, make sure you have nice space. <laughs> extend both of your legs here. Good. Inhale, just reaching up to the sky. Sit up nice and tall. And then exhale, bend your left knee, bring the knee towards the inner thigh, look up, and then exhale, just begin to walk your fingers forward towards your ankle. And again, maybe you're at the ankle, maybe you're even behind the knee, that's totally fine as well. Just keep the front foot flexed so you're engaging the entire back of your leg here. Maybe your forehead comes down towards that knee, just breathing deeply, just for a moment here. And this is a really beautiful way to get a little bit deeper and awaken those hamstrings there. Or one hamstring at a time. All right, one more deep breath in. Exhale, come on up. Bring your knee in, cross it over and just give it a hug with your right arm as you look over your left shoulder into a gentle spinal twist. Back to center. Let's just switch sides. Same thing. Bend your other knee now. Place it to the inner thigh. Inhale, reach up. And exhale. Maybe hands underneath, onto the ankle, or all the way down. Close your eyes in this position and just go inward for this moment. Focusing on your inhalation and exhalation. And just allowing your mind to find stillness just for this moment. Just think about your breath. This is your moment in your day where you can connect to yourself, to your own energy, to your breath. Beautiful. Slowly come back up. Bring your knee in and a little crossover. And just hug this right knee with your left elbow. And then the right arm is going to reach all the way to the back as you look over your right shoulder. Little spinal twist. Beautiful, and then come forward, release the leg, and then you can just shake it out. And then scoot forward, come to the very front of your mat, or maybe to the uh, center of your mat, as I am doing, whatever's comfortable for you. And just take a breath, place your hands onto your heart. And this is just our way to close off this very quick and gentle warm up of the body practice so you can start your day. So just close your eyes for this last few breaths. Connect to your heart. Connect to your own energy, to your power. And allow this energy within your heart to guide you forward through your day today. To allow you to always react through love, to speak through love, through kindness and to share your light with the rest of the world. Thank you so much for joining me here today. Beautiful Mystica. I hope you have a beautiful day, beautiful morning, and I look forward to seeing you again on the mat. Thank you. Namaste.